right, Dave's going to go over uh, putting water in the unit. Of course, obviously checking for water leaks and stuff, and then uh, we'll get into uh, starting it up. Okay, anytime that we're done installing the boiler with any type of piping or any soldering, any type of you know pipe work at all, um, what we would do is we would shut off the valves that go up to your radiators. Um, on this setup here, we don't have the valves, um, but in the earlier video there, we showed you about putting the valve on each side. So there'd be a valve here and a valve here. We shut those down. We'll come over to here where we put that fill line on. We'll open this up. We'll let that fill until we achieve about 25 pounds of pressure inside the boiler. And on the pressure gauge, 25 pounds is right there marked. Once you get to that point, you'll go ahead and we'll shut down the uh, boiler feed and that way it stops all water running into the boiler. Check your pipes for leaks. If you're good with leaks, what we would end up doing is we'd open up this valve that would be there and we would open this valve and then we would go ahead and fill the whole system. We would usually set it to about 20 pounds to start with um, because when you go to bleed it, you want a little bit of pressure in there to push the, the air through.